Hello and welcome to Two Minutes of Anatomy. I am Dr. Donald Ozello of Championship Chiropractic in Las Vegas, Nevada. On today's episode of Two Minutes of Anatomy, I'm going to speak about the supraspinatus muscle. The supraspinatus muscle is one of the four muscles in the rotator cuff muscle group. The supraspinatus muscle has its origin at the medial two-thirds of the supraspinatus fossa. The supraspinatus fossa is located on the posterior side of the scapula and it is superior to the scapular spine. The tendon of the supraspinatus muscle passes superior to the glenohumeral joint and it inserts in the superior and middle impression of the greater tuberosity of the humerus. It helps to act as the upper stabilizer of the glenohumeral joint. The concentric actions of the supraspinatus muscle are abduction and external rotation. The primary concentric action is abduction, and it's extremely important for the initial 15 degrees of abduction when the arm is against the side of the trunk. The supraspinatus muscle is innervated by the suprascapular nerve from vertebral levels C4, C5, and C6. Again, the supraspinatus muscle is one of the four muscles in the rotator cuff muscle group. Its origin is the medial two-thirds of the supraspinatus fossa. Its insertion is the superior and middle impression of the greater tuberosity of the humerus. Its concentric actions are abduction and external rotation. Its primary concentric action is abduction, especially for the initial 15 degrees of abduction, and it is innervated by the suprascapular nerve from vertebral levels C4, C5, and C6.